Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. My name is Sky. Thank you so much for joining me for my God of War playthrough. In the last part, we made it to the summit of the mountain where we seen Balder and his nephews talking to Mimir. They were trying to ask about Kratos and his son, but Mimir told him to F off. So after they left, we chopped Mimir's head off, took him to the witch. She brought him back to life. So now his head can talk again. And then Mimir talked to the world serpent about Jotunheim and he's gonna help us get there because apparently that's where the highest point in all the realms is instead of the mountain. And we officially learned that the witch's name is Freya, even though that was already spoiled for me. But wow, a lot happened and I'm very excited to start playing again. So let's get into it. I know I mentioned about, um, let me know if I should do the side quest or not. I'm recording this before that's posted, but I do feel pretty confident about not doing a side quest yet because I was even looking at the map and I still don't have a lot open. And yes, I 100% I of this area, I could I can't even use the mystic gates gateways yet so i don't really know i feel like like this right here this should possibly be a path but i think that's being blocked i don't know maybe i'll check it out i think i'm just gonna continue with the main quest for now i know there's probably plenty of time to do side quests ah, i can read what this says now but it's a name Air. Whoa. the name made it light up it's the Ooh. name of one of the Valkyries. That's quite curious. Valkyrie? What is that? Okay. Alright, we're heading this way. But I definitely don't want to completely ne neglect the side quests. I don't know that I'm going to 100% everything. Especially if it starts getting close to Ragnarok and I feel like I'm running out of time. Which shouldn't be the case. But the, the goal is to we try to play the game pretty thoroughly. Now. That's my goal. We'll go exploring for a little while. I'm happy with whatever you want to do. Huh. Oh, that kind of insinuated that I could go exploring. Hmm. Okay, well, we 100 percented the Vanaheim Tower. So these are towers. Okay. It's starting to make sense here. Let me actually... Let's go in the water. Let's do a little bit of exploration, I guess. I said I wasn't going to do that, but now Atreus has convinced me, of course. Let me actually go and find out what I can do. A lot of stuff may be blocked. Keep rowing towards the statues of the oarsmen, then thread past between them. Oh, so I'm literally accidentally continuing with the quest. Okay. Let me backtrack actually. Maybe we can do per episode. Maybe we can do like a side quest and Amir, a um, you never did tell me why Freya's been your main quest. Well, she blames me in large measure for her present circumstances, and not totally without reason. It all goes back to the long war between the Aesir and Vanir. Prior to that, wars for the Aesir were easily won, but the Vanir had proved their equal and exacted devastating damage. And we'll pick this up later. Um, interesting. If I have a hard time with this, then I will wait a little bit longer. Come back in a second. Maybe I need to... Okay, so these are level 5 enemies. Let's put Clark in here. Yeah. 
little easier than I thought. Maybe I'm getting ahead of myself. Let me keep going up. We'll see if I can piece this together. I mean, I get what needs to happen. It either needs to, like, fall or it needs to rotate so that it's closer to the chest. Or something like that. Come and face me, God of Thunder! Your challenges mean nothing to the God, Spirit. They do not listen. Do not mock my pursuit of vengeance. Though my family devoted their lives to worshipping Thor, I've devoted mine to his downfall. And I will start with that statue looming over my father's grave. Unlikely. You are dead. Is there something we can do? For a reward, of course. <laughs> if you bring down the statue, you have my blessing to loot my father's grave. He rests on an island to the east. Destroy the Why statue of Thor. Thor. So After my father passed, my mother built the statue to watch over his grave. Imagine our surprise when the God of Thunder himself came to offer condolences. At first we were thrilled, but he quickly took advantage of our hospitality. My mother begged him to leave, and Thor, in his drunken rage, killed her. I was left wow. with nothing but grief. Eventually I lost that as well, and found only rage in its place. I... I'm so sorry. Come, boy. We have a statue to destroy. Wow. What a P.O.S. Curse Tazzleworm. This Tazzleworm doesn't have the poisonous barb, but it does have a sack in its throat that lets it barf poison at us. I know it's really gross. The poison is deadly to the touch, so even if we dodge the attack, we still need to be careful not to step in it. Okay. So I can't go that way. I'm definitely missing something here. I don't know. I guess we can continue on and then loot it later. Boy. Yes, sir. Another map. That will find some. <laughs> Gateway. The boat captain's key. Find the location from the scroll. Oh, it's under goals. I was trying to figure out where the treasure maps were. With the boat captain in the belly of the Hydra. With the boat captain in the belly of the Hydra, the key was mine. I traveled to a new land, but my wrecked, my ship wrecked and sunk along with my precious key. It lies just below the waves, perched on an underwater peak. That 
damn boat captain cannot get away from us. Okay. This grave lies on an island to the east. Do not mistake my mother's statue of Thor with that monstrous eyesore to the south. Okay. Something is not right. I feel like we're supposed to get that thing rotating somehow so then it comes down here close I think that's the key is to get the thing rotating, but how? That's a whole nother set of questions. That spirit. The one whose mom was killed by Thor? What about it? Let his story be a reminder. The lives of men mean nothing to the gods. I know, Father. You know. But do you listen? Yes. <laughs> Good. Last we were in a boat, we had just started the story. What did you want to tell me about the long war? Both sides suffered tremendous losses. And for many of us, quite frankly, war was simply no fun anymore. But a rather senseless waste of precious life. Wouldn't you agree, brother? Okay, Precisely. No. Enough was enough. And at last, Odin's most brilliant advisor became determined to find a more enlightened path. He set about to broker a peace between the gods. It took some convincing, but ultimately Odin was persuaded to marry his deadliest enemy, a certain Vanir goddess, legendary not only for her fertile beauty, but her genius at the very Vanir magic that Odin had long aspired to master. Freya married Odin? Well, I can just tell you the story later. middle of my attack? It's kind of messed up. Thank you. Oh, I forgot about the range. Some health back. 
Oh, shit. Off the ground challenge. Ready. All right. Okay. What did that do? See, I don't have that ability. Okay. I'm fully convinced that I'm not ready for this yet. Unfortunately. Wait, what? It's bugged. I know this is in the bird's path. <sighs> We're bugged. Be here a while. I don't think I can use the chain because it's detecting an enemy, right? Okay. Yeah, I don't know. I'll definitely just come back once I have the ability to burn the blue branches because I would hate to just, like barely be able to complete Here. these side the quests the and have to come back to every one of them. What was in it for her? It was a sacrifice to protect her people. A selfless act of love. Truly, she deserves better than she got. 
But of course, there's more to that story. Boy. Sir. Nightmare, sir. <laughs> Awful <of> day. <laughs> I see improvement. Okay. We can either dodge their shots or interrupt them with an arrow or axe, so the stronger ones can shoot faster. Keep getting off like off task here. Let's just see what's up here, and then uh, I hear Brock or someone. Okay, this is a probably another side quest. Usually, Brock was at the last one, and Brock has been, I think, at every single quest that's about to start, or Sindri. Okay, to the main quest. The Mason's Channel, okay. We can beach the boat here. Let's look around. Do we see any of Odin's? Gulfik. You were taken from this realm too early. <laughs> You who walks among the living, my beloved Gulvig calls to me. She yearns for peace, yet her remains lie in pieces. I beg of you, make my Gulvig whole again. You want us to collect her bones? Gross. Gulvig's sailor magic knows no bounds. She can reunite you with those you've lost. Really? How? Boy. I can smell your grief, child. Rest assured, her magic is strong enough to create bridges between life and death. If only for a short while. Boy, we are leaving. Interesting. They've taken three of sweet Gulvig's bones and spread them across the lake. I mean, I wait. Bring me her bones, child. Gulvig will reward you. Ah, good. The special chisel is ahead past this gate. Dark Oh, sh walked right into that. 
Father, maybe we should look for those bones. Why? Didn't you hear him? We could talk to mom again. If we keep an eye out, what could we... you wish, boy? I will not be distracted by this fool's errand. <sighs> okay. Well, we're gonna look. This chisel we seek. What is it? I'm glad you asked, actually. I have just the story for you. <laughs> There was a giant once named Thamu. A very giant giant. Who, despite his mountainous size, was without question the greatest stonemason this world had ever seen. Proud Thamu or hoped to one day pass his vast knowledge onto his son. But young Hrimthur had the heart of a warrior. Perhaps the father had too much fear in him, or the son too little. Either way, a quarrel of theirs spiraled out of control, and the overworked stonemason, bonk, struck his son. Arimthur ran off into the night. Feeling shame and regret, Thamur chased after his son, but in his emotional state, soon found himself wandering Midgard, lost and alone. Sadly, he caught the eye of the one person he didn't want to meet alone that night, so far from home. Thor. Oh, man. And what happened next? You'll see. Thor killed him. I know. You found a village? Aye. When Thamur fell, he crushed a charming place famed for worshipping the Vanir god Njord. Thor always took credit for planning that one. But the truth is, the sweaty ball bag just got lucky. Wow. Enemies. On your mark. So the only traveling I can do is right here. Right? A dangerous beast. We will take him down together. Okay. 
chisel. The tip of one, yes. A very, very giant chisel. Oh. Magically sealed, I'm afraid. Break this. Just help. Brother, looks like that crystal's brimming again. No. Go the other way. So smart. Oh, Big brain. His idea. to the survivors oh thamur was a frost giant but when he died his final breath froze everything this is locked up good did not count as a secret okay Oh, wow. There he is. Find the tip of that chisel. That's the magic we need. Okay. The magic chisel, retrieve a piece of the chisel. Well, what's the plan? And I'll find light crystal. There's a freaking monster thing! Damn. 
Oh my god. Oh my god. Frost sigil of defense, increased resistance to frost attacks. Okay. Probably need that for this area. Ice ancient, an ancient in the ice and snow. I wonder if they have thoughts like we do. I can't hear any. They don't have mouths or ears. None that I can see anyways. They're mostly pretty peaceful unless we attack first. I'd never say this to father, but I wish we could just leave them alone. Should we just leave them alone? How do I do? You have potential, boy. You're great. Hey, how do you increase that? That's Andy. What does it say? To Njord, we offer back the seas back. Ah, yes. It was believed that Njord calmed the winds and seas for the fishermen. For that, they loved and worshipped him here. For a god, Njord doesn't sound too bad. As soon as I put it down, I see where it needs to go. Okay. Oh God. have to fight anything that's odd why did I not have to fight anything betray us to me ah. Ah. okay so we're looking for um Sideways mountains flag R. So let's see where this one's at. Oh, 
Oh my gosh. Okay, no. Must be the next one. Yep. Okay, so we have that in place. Now we're looking. There's something up there. Up where? Oh, I see. Okay. Have to be that, right? Yes. Mark of the Ranger, legendary enchantment, increases damage of all axe throws by six percent. That one's probably a good one to put on. Okay, so I think I found close to everything. A lot going on right here. That's everything. We can start heading this way. So this giant was actually a giant. How are we getting down there? I have a plan. You do? Do not act so surprised. Oh, no offense, brother, but I don't even think Thor with Mjolnir in hand could get through that much ice. Then Thor is a fool. This should be entertaining. <laughs> oh boy. Okay. I was late.
Oh. Can't see anything, we're in the upper, okay. Like, is he okay? Wow, that was uh, something that though. Fight. Here, catch. Well, that was a waste of a perfectly good hour. How were you not seen? There is nowhere here to hide. Oh, that. It's a little trick my people can pull. A special way of not being seen. You can be invisible? More like I can step into the realm between realms. And your mind doesn't understand what it's seeing, so it sees nothing at all. That's how we avoid ever having to actually use the weapons we craft. It, uh... It doesn't seem to work on dragons, though. <laughs> Your brother wanted to know if you are getting enough to eat. I guess I could tell him you are. Brock was asking about me? <laughs> was there meat on his breath? <laughs> Ask about the arrows. You let him touch this again. <laughs> Come on, then. They did a good job with this character. 
So that's how Brock was in the temple right after the water. He stepped between realms. Okay now, shush. I need complete silence for this. There you go. Okay. So, this plan of yours. Can you guess it? Knowing you, it doesn't involve standing around here. Correct. But how do we move forward? Okay. Boy, Garmor really liked jewelry, didn't he? He <laughs> even braided his beard with it. I happen to think he looks dashing. You know, he has no couple of boys. Okay. Did I mess up by over there? What? We heading into that building? Yes. You think there's something inside that'll help us break the ice and get to the chisel tip? No. Hmm. I'll keep thinking. Okay, I can't block that. Oh, okay, I can't block that. Hold on. Some help. I guess I dodged too soon. Oh, I pressed it! I'm pressing it! I'm about to lose my mind.
Okay, how do I get up there? Travel Traveler champion. This traveler has a huge shield on his back, which makes breaking through his extremely tough armor even tougher. Come here. You knew this place? Before? I came here on a diplomatic mission once, trying to broker a peace between Asgard and Vanaheim. That war. So many lives lost. What I didn't know was Thor had already gone on a killing spree of giants. What did the giants have to do with the war between the gods? Nothing at all, lad. That's the tragedy of it. They took no side in that madness. But Odin's paranoia is surpassed only by Thor's lust for blood. There's some sort of reason I'm supposed to climb that. Ah! Stop! Why? Why wouldn't he stop? I didn't mean to do that. Oh, yeah, I think that's what I'm supposed to do. Interesting. Okay, you can't get down like that.
Another crystal. Just give the word. <laughs> What now? Mm, good question. Um, I think we're supposed to swing it, I guess. Oh, okay, I see. Oh, we got most of it. Yeah, that's looking good. Stealthy plan it is not. Now we must free the other strap. We do? Okay, where do we go to do that? back oh no okay we're climbing we're up. Going up and what we need is all the way down there think well the chisel tip is under thick layers of ice so melting it won't work correct and there weren't any shattered crystals nearby for me to shoot so that's not an option correct I just leave smashing the ice we need something ridiculously heavy to oh I get it now good Smart boy. Okay. How are we going to turn the hammer so it lands near the chisel tip? Not possible. We cut it free, write it down, and figure out what comes next after. So your plan involves a whole bunch of luck then. You are welcome to suggest a different one. Release the strap. Yeah. Hold tight. Oh gosh, this is um probably gonna go south, maybe we'll see. Uh but the plan seems ill advised. Jump! Little ways. All right, so we got more to do. Let's figure it out. Get 
Boy. What does it say? When time itself is disarrayed, the forward path is retrograde. Retrograde? It's backwards? Those symbols. The seasons? Yeah. It is all jumbled. Shouldn't it be winter, spring, summer, autumn? Why start with winter? It's from a song Mother used to sing. Don't I know that one? Winter that... Quiet head. Doesn't like music either. Got it. Winter... Well, let me see what the other symbol is. That'd be, that would definitely be summer. So winter... Spring... Summer... Autumn? Boy! Vetter! Bauer! Sumar! House! It didn't work, but I know that's the order in the song Mom said. Okay, so I guess over here. Winter. Spring. Summer. Autumn? Do it. You know, most people go from Atreus, left to right. That word. Thola. It means endure. Try it. Thola. Oh my goodness. God, this game is so cool. Write it again. Wow. Keep writing. Head. How is this possible? My guess? Temporal magic. Dangerous stuff the High Vanir gods used to play around with. The ability to freeze time. Happened to be a favorite of New Ord himself, in fact. Used to? Why did they stop? Well, turns out stopping time keeps the sun and moon from streaking across the sky. Unfortunately, it does not stop the wolves that chase them. Always looking to sink their teeth in. After that, they decided it was best to leave time alone. I can't get to the Collapses. There'll probably be another wave, I'm guessing. Yep. Oh, 
Oh god, there's another wave. Not again. Oh yeah, I forgot about these. They explode. Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh my god. Boy. Like I was doing the most there too. Oh my goodness. Yo. We're almost to the top. The hell are we supposed to do? see any of the Odin birds. Well, there it is. How are we going to get it free? A push. But Trust me. Ready. Dig in and push with everything. Yes, sir. <laughs> So cute. How do we get down? We jump. Really? Come. 
Is the ice collapsing? Give the man credit. He has a talent for destroying oh. things. Remember that head. Never leaves my mind. Well, I want to drop down. Those are the guys we saw with Baldur. His nephews? Aye. Magni and Modi. The sons of Thor. Mother always said the Aesir were the worst of gods. And Thor was the worst of the Aesir. Guess he's a terrible father, too. They are no longer children. They have no excuse. Will Sindri be okay? True. They'll never even see him. Don't see any birds. Are they just super well hidden? Ah, the great dining hall. Envy of all Midgard. Funny. I remember there being a massive candelabrum. Really lighted up the place. There. Ah, yes. You just can't help but break things, can you? If memory serves, the Jarl's throne was just on the other side of that wall of ice. Come on. Oh! <laughs> 
I can't. Aw, come on. I could blow him up. That explodes, okay. I can see a path out, but there's no way to reach it. Okay. Well. We're definitely missing some stuff. Be ready. Oh my god, you guys have me in a corner. Okay, this one is vicious. Okay, I have to block this one's attacks. That one's fast. Okay. Okay, wow. I was getting uh, super stuck. Ready 
I'm hoping that I can get to that chest this way. Something ahead. See, lad, he's fine. Thought it best to vanish when Thor's idiot Would sons showed up. You quit that shit. Hey, Sindri, check this out. My, we're excited to spend some hack silver, aren't we? Oh, the travelers. Oh, disgusting. Mm, smelly, covered in God knows how many little beasties, but gorgeous armor. Let's see if I can't make something more sanitary. Yes. Labor complete. New recipes unlocked. Okay. Cool. Let's do it. Okay, I can't upgrade. Anything you need, young sir. I can upgrade his bow. So I might as well. Hmm, what shall it be? I'm trying to decide if I should stop here or keep going. No. I'm gonna keep going because I think we're pretty close to completing this so why not It'll be a longer episode Brother, we may get a piece of the chisel and be gone before they even notice. Uh -oh. yeah. I should have known. Boy. I should have known. Surrender. 
The old father demands it. No. <sighs> no. Good. This fight is mine, boy. Go. <clears throat> and where do you think you are? Uh-uh. Oh no, brother. The little freak's got a bow. What are we gonna do? <laughs> Don't tell me what to do, brother. Don't take lightly the people who are weird toward kids. Oh wait, I can't dodge that. I didn't notice. up here. Does Odin want? Come here, You done hand. Shut up! Don't call me that. Can't believe you lasted this long. No skinny little arms can barely do it. I said, shut up! Calm yourself, boy. Looks like they need a lesson. Oh, we're gonna see something out of Atreus, aren't we? Your 
This I see them. is my favorite. It's a boss house. I'm doing it, I guess? making him sick sickness fever has returned no it hasn't boy <sighs> the coffin the blood the boy's sick he needs flair no steady I'll be all right there you go, lad. I'm fine, see? No. We should keep an eye on him. Frozen flame. Lightning infused metal use. Okay. No, I don't want anything to happen to him. It's magically locked.
Enough. Should do. With that, we okay. can carve the travel room to Jotunheim. Get you where you need to go. Oh, incidentally, all those magically sealed doors we've seen can now be unlocked. Like that one round the corner. You can get through that door there now that you've got the chisel. Oh, okay. So now we can use these doors. Find the binding point with and then press to strike. No? Great, so we've you, killed an Asir. He did. He was a god, but you killed him. Minor Aesir, perhaps, but I. And his father's Thor. Not minor. Not minor at all, him. No. This mm. will not go over well in Asgard. I defended us. Nothing more. I fear no judgment. Judgment, no. But if vengeance is any concern. Since when can you kill a god? <coughs> Tell the boy the truth, jeez. Wouldn't be in here, would it? Poor Fafnir. I usually There's don't fine do that. And greed, you know? Wait, we are here before. Which way back? Do that, so it is probably out there somewhere. I'm just not seeing it. Oh, there it is. I don't think the lad's doing too well. I'm fine. <laughs> if so, then keep up. Yes, sir. Hey, I just realized Magni didn't come back to life. 
That is interesting. It's known the Aesir find their own way to Valhalla. No Valkyrie escort, no processing at the gates of Helheim. That may be significant. Just the realms. So I guess you don't always have to fight for it. Look, back near the giant's head. What? What is this place? Fisherman would bring the day's catch into this port and use that contraption to send some of it directly to the Jarl's main kitchen. The rest were sorted and sold. There is an exit under the thumb. Find a way across. Moving. There is an opening. I can get it. There's a path to the exit. On the other side. Can he put this chain down? Oh, no, he doesn't do that? Okay. Let's get back to the boat. under his palm. We're almost there. Yeah. 
Okay, I see. Everything we just did. Climbed around a dead giant. Wrote a giant falling hammer. Fought some bad gods. What do you think Mother would say? Bet you have come a long way. Thanks. There's something over there. I'm having a hard time all of a sudden. Father, over there. What? The heck's in here? A hidden chamber. Okay, this is this part's gotten really long. We can always come back. Let's check this out, and then we'll be done. Look here, another. Ah, you know this one, don't you? It's Thamu, the giant stonemason. Is he building a wall around Jotunheim? It was to be his masterwork. He only wanted to protect his people. Too bad the first part got burned. I prefer the last panel was burned. Such a senseless pity. Samir, the greatest stonemason and one of the biggest giants of all, he argues with his son. Rithmer strikes him and gets lost looking for him. Thor chisels the mirror in the head and crashes crushes the whole town. Thamir Thamir Thamir? I think it was Thamir. Was building a wall around Jotunheim to protect giants from the Aesir. Did he ever get finished? Who knows? Damn, these gods are a-holes. All right, you guys, I'm going to stop here. It's definitely a longer one, but I wanted to try to complete-ish that quest instead of stopping when I knew that I had to have been close to the end just because it only showed like 80 meters until the chisel. I really hope nothing happens to Atreus. I would be heartbroken if he dies at this point. I hope it's nothing too bad. Maybe Freya can fix him. I hope you guys enjoyed watching this part, and I will see you for the next one. Bye, guys.